Hey guys, Chris with Headlight Revolution, and today I've got a Nissan Titan in the shop. We're doing taillight upgrades, and I've got a lot of cool stuff to show you. In particular, I've got some sweet reverse lights that are fresh off the shelf from GTR Lighting. They are the Ultra Series reverse lights. Now, I'm sure you've seen these ones in my left hand before. We've got the reflex lights. We've got the crystal lens. And while they are awesome bulbs and they perform really well, these new Ultra Series bulbs are where it's at. Now the first step in taking this tail light out is just removing these two 10 millimeter bolts. One on top, one on bottom, and then just pull the tail light toward you. Give these a counterclockwise twist to remove them. And I'm going to set this tail light off to the side. Now, for the tail lights and the turn signals, I've got the GTR Lighting Lightning Series bulbs today. These Lightning Series bulbs perform extremely well as turn signals and brake light replacements. They are much brighter than stock. Unplug the stock halogen lights and you'll notice these Lightning Series bulbs fit just like the factory bulbs. Now, this middle light right here is actually the cargo light in the tail light coming out of the side of it. And for those, I'm gonna do these reflex series bulbs from GTR Lighting. Those are gonna fit that slot nice. They really put out a lot of light, but they're not as critical as a reverse light. And like I said earlier, for the reverse light, we're gonna be doing these sweet ultra series bulbs from GTR Lighting. Now I've played with these a little bit off camera, and these are a tremendous, tremendous bulb, especially for the money. Really a lot of light output. Small form factor for the amount of light that you get out of these things. That's a, a main consideration when it comes to these is you don't always have a mile of room for a huge bulb. And so it's really nice to have something so compact and still so bright. All right, now one final step before we put this stuff back in the tail light and reassemble the vehicle, we need to wire in a resistor. And on this truck, it's pretty easy. There's only two wires coming off of the turn circuit right here, or the turn signal bulb right here. We've got a black and we've got a green with no stripe, just a black and a green. And so what you do, GTR Lighting supplied us with this load equalizing resistor kit. It's specific for this truck. And it comes with everything you need to make this work. Including these T-taps. And we're not gonna use those today. We're gonna solder it up. We have the means to, and, and it just makes a better connection. You can certainly use these if you want. They work just fine. The first thing I like to do, take a drill, a Phillips bit. Here's a tip for you. Put the screw in the resistor first. That way, if you happen to drop it or it slides out of your hand, it doesn't go bouncing off into the abyss behind the truck. And just find some real estate back here that, that uh, isn't really in the way. Now, it's really important to mount this resistor to metal. The reason for that is it does get pretty hot. You don't want to melt it to plastic. You don't want to just zip tie it to any wiring. Mount it to metal, you won't have any issues that way. With the resistor mounted, strip a little wiring back. And the cool part about these resistors, I mean, they're awfully simple things. You just need to connect the resistor wires to the turn signal wires. One wire from the resistor goes to the turn signal power wire, and the other resistor wire goes to the turn signal ground. Twist this around here. Now one thing that's nice about these vehicle specific kits from GTR Lighting is they come with just about everything you could ever need. And that's nice for the guy that's just trying to do something on the weekend that maybe doesn't work on things all the time and doesn't want to be fighting with stuff or trying to figure out what bulb fits and what looks the best and what's the brightest. These things are all tested significantly and then we get them and then we test them and then we film a video on it. So we know exactly what fits, we know what works. This stuff works for your truck. We're installing these resistors to prevent the turn signals from blinking quickly. This is called hyperflash and it can be very annoying. We want everything to work as it did from the factory. Now with the resistor wired in and mounted, 
it'd be a good time to go ahead and test all your bulbs, make sure everything works, put it in reverse with the key on, make sure your reverse light works. If you, any of your bulbs don't work right off the bat, one thing you may need to do is remove the bulb, flip it around, and plug it back in. They're polarity specific, unlike your factory bulbs. If everything works, go ahead and put these back in the tail light and put the bolts back in and you're done. Move on to the next side. As you can see, we've got a significant difference here. We've got a nice crisp on and off with that bulb for our turn signal. We've got a nice and bright uh, parking light, which is even brighter when the brakes are applied. We'll show you the reverse light. It is phenomenal. This kit is great. It fits the truck perfectly. Everything works fine. Definitely a good solution for you if you've got a Nissan Titan. And this covers from 03 to 15. So it's all the same. This will work for your truck. Thanks for watching. We've got a ton of stuff for these Nissan Titans. We just got done shooting a headlight video uh, a couple days ago. And man, if you need headlights for this truck, check that video out. I'll post a link for you guys, but certainly something you should be looking for. Interior lights, the same thing. We've got awesome interior lights for these trucks. GTR Lighting is, uh, is the brand to go to for those. Thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe to our channel if you've got one of these Nissan Titans. <laughs>